would have been a nice day to read outside. <laughs> yeah, especially because you got rain chances tomorrow. Uh, Temperature still going to be mild, but then that change is going into Monday. So hopefully you did everything outdoors that you need to get done today. Because like I said, those changes are starting to roll in over the next couple of hours. As we look outside right now from our camera atop the Batman building, it's a quiet night across much of Middle Tennessee. 65 degrees after a high of 73, 49 our morning low. Three or four one hundredths of an inch of rain have fallen since midnight officially in Nashville. A little bit of rainfall out there right now over towards uh, parts of the plateau. Then uh, as you get along the Tennessee River and then going towards West Tennessee and into Arkansas as well. This right here is the culprit that's really uh, causing all the problems. This is a frontal boundary that's going to bring heavy rain to the area, maybe even a thunderstorm and the concerns for some flash flooding too as we head into tomorrow afternoon. Tonight, any severe potential as well to our west, but tomorrow we see that potential shifting over Middle Tennessee and Southern Kentucky. It's a one out of five. That's a marginal risk, the lowest on our scale, and it's what's prompted us from three tomorrow afternoon till midnight to call for a storm five alert for the News Channel 5 viewing area. 11 a.m. You're going to have some showers, and I think these morning showers will help to take some of the energy out of the atmosphere as far as uh, any type of significant severe thunderstorm threat or even a tornado threat. But the real concern is going to be the heavy rainfall for long periods of time. Three o'clock that could bring some heavy rain to the area all the way towards five and beyond. And that could create some flash flooding for tomorrow afternoon and evening, which is what has the biggest concern for our storm five alert. We're talking about an inch to three inches of rain with the uh, bullseyes basically being from about Hopkinsville through Murray, Kentucky and going west of that. So that's where we'll watch for the best potential for flash flooding tomorrow. Not saying that there is no tornado threats incredibly low. Can't rule it out altogether though, but flash flooding still the main concern. So going through tonight, I'm looking for 60 to be that low temperature and then your seven day forecast. We'll see temperatures tomorrow climbing to 71, but the storm five alert with us behind this front 50 as we dry out 45 for the final day of 2019. We start the new year at 50 and rain chances are back Thursday, Friday and Saturday. Tomorrow though, again, afternoon hours, that is when we are most concerned for the heaviest rain that could bring flash flooding.